Hi everyone, it's me Darlene. I'm in Walmart's parking lot. I did not go in the store. I came to pick up the keyboard and mouse that I just bought for my new laptop uh, or the old laptop, depending on you know which keyboard I like to use the most. The keyboard I have is not that wide and I like that because I can type and yet use the mouse and not have to have like my hand way over here. This keyboard is a couple inches longer, so I don't know, I don't know, or wider, I should say. So fussy. So I ordered that last night, and um, you just pick it up like you're picking up groceries, and I thought I would do that. I could go in the store, because I do need a few things, but I'm not doing that today, because I'm pretty busy. I'm pretty busy today, and hopefully all weekend. I have been working a little bit on my computer, every day or night and yesterday I was able to um, upload, download, install Chrome. One of those things I did that. <laughs> so I have Chrome now and it has been a long time since I did it but I remembered there was a way to move my bookmarks over and I accomplished that. It took me a long time to figure it out. But I figured it out. I asked Google, how do I do this step? And uh, I got it. The thing is, is a lot of times it requires a password that I haven't used in four years. <laughs> so, but I do have password managers, which helps it. Anyway, uh, I'm, I'm getting there step by step. And what I want to do is, and I just thought of this today, and I'm going to text Derek and ask him, you know, whenever it's good this weekend, I want to do this. He uses, I believe, Filmora. I think I had tried the free version of that once upon a time, and I just gave up. I was like, I, 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 I can't, I can't move away from my program, what I'm using. So, but I, I need to move away and step away and do something new, something that's not um, ancient. So I thought of asking him when he's home at his apartment. And, uh, you know, while he's actually there, I want him to set me up so I can try Filmora. And it, it's not the free version. Derek doesn't take shortcuts <laughs> like I do. But I am very willing to pay for um, video editing if I like it. So I'm going to ask him to set me up and I'm going to go through the steps as though I were... Uh, editing a video. I'll just use an old video and just to see, to see how it is, to see if I like it. And then if I like it okay, he knows it. So I can always ask him for help. Isn't that a very good idea? I think it is. So I'm, I'm feeling hopeful about that step. And I've got, I've got a you know, quite a few things to tell you before I forget. I'm looking, I have a list. Uh, Derek will have a cover song tonight. This is Friday, 6 p.m. Central. It's coming out. And I, I'm going to shamelessly plug his Patreon because those videos are not monetized. And he also pays to have them edited and all that. I know he doesn't have to do that, but he wants to. He wants to try to make them as nice as possible. So I'm going to send you over to his Patreon if you want. He has three levels, $1, uh, $5, $10, but you can actually pledge whatever you want and then you just, you know, have to pick your tier. And for right now, all tiers are just going to, you know, it, it's just, it's just donating. It's fan funding. There's nothing specifically offered because uh, it's just supporting his, his cover music is, is what it is. And some people like to support only a buck and some people are willing to give more. So it, there's just options there and it's monthly and it is set up. Oh, Patreon has finally changed the way they do subscriptions. It used to be that if you subscribed like on the last day of a month, you paid but then you automatically paid on the first of the month. And that used to piss people off. It was uh, a monthly pledge that uh, Patreon would collect on the first day of every month 
no matter when you actually joined. But they changed that now, and Derek is set up that way. And I just changed it for my Patreon today. So now when somebody subscribes, like I think today is the 9th of December, something like that, they will pay on the 9th of every month. So it's not like um, if they joined up on December 28th, they're going to pay and then pay again right away on January 1st. So I just wanted to pass that by you. I have Patreon too, if you want, if you want to go do that. But I'm, I'm, uh, I'm pushing for Derek right now. So the cover tonight is another rhythm guitar one. It's another song I never heard. And it's even a, a band I've never heard of. And I listened to it and I, uh, not his, but I had to go look on it on YouTube for it because his isn't up yet and just never heard that song no nothing I don't I don't know where he comes up with this music that I've never heard of <laughs> and I know the peeps that are my age and up who are all in love with the disco songs are not really the ones watching this but his comments on the last one he did Pearl Jam animals was that was that the name of the song which I ended up loving, and I can listen to it over and over again. I just, I knew Pearl Jam, but never heard that song. Um, he got good comments from names that neither one of us recognize. So I'm glad about that. That means he did bring in new subscribers who were there for that stuff. Uh, and But he will be doing all kinds. He will still be doing some disco. I think right now he's got a few in the can for the the rhythm guitar and but it's all good as for me I have decided and I feel like I will be able to do it I have to get back to sewing quilting crafts some of those videos I have to try to do at least uh, you know at least one per week I I want to still do my car vlogs. I want to still do, obviously, videos with Derek. But uh, I need to get back to that. I think once I get back to it, I'll find the love for it again. I just need to force myself because I, uh, you know, obviously when I make changes like that, I, I lose a lot of subscribers. A lot of the people who were here for just that kind of content have left. And, you know, and I understand that and I, I have to accept it. It's just like losing a lot of my patrons. I mean, a lot. Because when I said that I was going to be stopping the fabric sales, and I know it might have sounded like I was stopping that completely. I really tried to explain that I was stopping it the way I'm doing it now. I can't be working 40 hours per week on fabric sales. I have to cut it down drastically, and I'm trying to think of other ways to do that. But anyway, I lost a lot of those patrons. And that that's a hard thing. For a couple of years, my income from Patreon and YouTube memberships was about 1500 per month or up. That's a lot to say, if I stop doing this, I'm going to lose this income. You know, it, 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 it's a big chunk of money. So for a long time, I have felt like a prisoner to this, you know, this fan funding thing. And I just try to keep it going, keep it going, keep it going until I'm completely worn out. And then it comes a time that I say, um, I just have to let go of that money because it's just not worth it anymore, because I, I'm, I'm miserable. <laughs> uh, and, I've, and I've lost a lot, you know? Uh, but there's still a nice chunk of people who have stayed, and uh, I'm still going to do the deal where I'm going to increase my level on those platforms. Uh, be, and I think, it, in a way, it's because uh, it will... Um, cut down the number of patrons I get. I'm, I'm wanting to keep what I have now. I'm not necessarily interested in adding because again, I don't want my Patreon and my memberships, my fan funding. I don't want that to be such a high number that I feel like I can't step away from it. You know, if I'm only collecting a few hundred dollars per month and I'm still way above that, but if I'm only collecting a few hundred dollars per month, I can walk away from that. It's hard to walk away from 1500 and up, you know? And if you think I'm letting the IRS know this and I'm being stupid, no, I, 
that's all claimed on my taxes. All, all that income, I claim all of that shit. Um, okay, so um, I'm going to try to do something crafty or quilty uh, this weekend. I, I really have to get back to at least just making quilt blocks. That can't possibly take me that long. As a matter of fact, I'd even like to try to do some of those as shorts. Shorts are going to be monetized in a different way than they already are. Um, ad revenue. I'm so excited. That's going to roll out, I believe, uh, February 1st. So I, I want to get better at shorts and then I can recycle those videos on TikTok where I get nothing. You have to have tons of subscribers and it's pennies. Uh, you know, where I could make a uh, hundred dollars maybe on something. Uh, on TikTok, you know, the, the creators are making dollars, you know, so it, it's vastly different than YouTube. But I like it for just getting myself out there. And I just, I just like TikTok. I spend so much time on there learning so much from such good creators. And so I'm excited. Can you tell? I have things to look forward to. But I'm going to try to knock out uh, some quilt block videos. Not, it's not going to all be shorts. And I really want to get back to my growing up crazy. So there's a lot of good things ahead. And I'm absolutely feeling new life by knowing that Derek and I both want to continue recording. I didn't know if he'd like recording with me. I mean, it's, it's me. <laughs> but he is the one who asked to do the, the third one that we just did. And now we're already planning our next one. I don't know if it will be every week. Uh, I'm thinking maybe, you know, every week to maybe 10 days. I, I would like us to keep it going. The comments have been phenomenal. I love good comments for him, you know, and it does give me a chance to see that, you know, there are nice people in this world, but it, it, it's still not my thing. I, it's a lot of work, a lot of time invested into monitoring comments and things like that. But I'm happy for him. Of, of course, it's his channel. He's doing it the way he wants. And, um, you know, the comments seem to show that you guys like it when we're doing a video together. So the next one, we're working on it. And uh, I think it'll be very funny. I, I really do. And, <laughs> and I'm excited. And uh, we'll try to do that uh, next week. Uh, okay? All right. I guess that's it. And, oh, do go subscribe to his channel, please. And then you won't miss that. All that info is in the uh, description below. Uh, I want to get home. Uh, I did buy packages today. It took me forever to get to the post office because traffic was backed up and I figured it must have been the train that goes right, ar right across Commerce and stops everybody from moving. So I, I took a back road, a side road that I wasn't familiar with and it took me too far away. It, it took me about 25 minutes to get to the post office when it's a 5 to 10 minute max trip. So that was fun, but uh, I, I, I'm learning all the back roads by, by doing this. And, okay, I guess that's it. I don't think there's anything else that I wanted to tell you as I look at my list and I have my keyboard. I'm going to go uh, try to hook that up today. That'll be a nice accomplishment. And, and uh, that's it. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.